Oh, he's got Falco, my nemesis. Spurs, what I've seen, all the Spurs are looking good again this season, aren't they? Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We yeah, but how long is he going to be there for? The players will be with us any time now. And here we have Brest against Peterborough. My name's Peter Drury and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Begley. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. We're ready to see what unfolds in this one now. The action has already started. Rudy Ayin tries to swing it, meets it first time! Oh, that probably deserved better. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Rudy Ayin, he's got away. Muniain with the ball through. Peterborough looking to seal their promotion here. They simply need to win. Dante. Who's he going to play in? Decent progress down the left. Camaro. He's he's got oh! Oh! Oh, he scored. There is the breakthrough. Origi with the smoothest one-on-one -on -one finish. He is one very cool customer. Peter, I can tell you that was nothing short of a cold-blooded execution. Peterborough take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Rest will play a certain way here, Jim. What is that way? They do prefer an element of caution, Peter, and, and get behind the ball in numbers, but those numbers have license to be carefree once a, a breakaway is sprung. Florenzi collects the ball from behind. Now it's Camero. Pulls out once more. And out it comes again. And it's hoisted clear. Now it's Falcao, looks to slip it through, now here's the through ball, going through, and that should be the keepers. Aldevero battles to win it back. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. Falcao into the channel. Bollocks. That's a throw.
Deflected behind for a corner kick. What? And that's been levered clear. They get a throw in. Camero. And it's Origi. Iniesta. So they got the only goal to make it 1 0. Lamina. Aimed long and direct. Fucking idiot, and he says. Rest ran themselves into the proverbial cul de sac there. Falcao. Now the pass. He slid it through. Fence has got rid of that. That's a throw. And it's Lamina. It's a throw in. Forward it goes. Bale pumps it into the area. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. And now they can launch a counter. Well, it really is one cross after another. Well, with a target to hit, why not keep up the supply? It's simple and, and efficient because they all know what they're doing. And he's there to hoof it away. Done very well to intervene. Dante. Bolt. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Referee's had a look and he's blown his whistle for half time. Well, there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Peterborough head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. And we're off again. Peterborough carry a one-goal lead into the second half. And it's Muniain. Muniain passes it through. And he just whacks it away. Tries to get it forward quickly. Tries a through ball. And it's kept out by a stubborn defence. Valka has a pop! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. <laughs> it's working a little bit better today. I'm playing better today. Well, I've been getting better at it, aren't this week? And that's the keepers. It's, it's definitely noticeable because I've... A draw and I'm leading. I'm doing well. Dante. Aimed long and direct. Playing FIFA's helped as well because it's got me a bit again. more into it. Now the pass. Dante goes to the cross. Oh. 
forward it goes. Origi is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, better communication and, and lots of contact seems to be there. <laughs> what a toss bag! Oh, he has stuck it into his own net! Oh, it's an unusual turn of events, and it was an honest attempt to help. Whatever was he doing? I suppose it can happen to anyone. Fortuitous as it may have been, they all count one. Oh, he's Muniain! Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Bolt. He's left his man. Chance to break. Fires it in low. He can get that clear. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Lorenzi stuck out a leg for a good challenge and it's Bale and he's whipped it in low rain starting to fall here it has been looking that way for a little while cleverly Looks to slip it through, and he's cut it out. That was one quality Ref! pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. Going for goal! He's done very well to get to that. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Get it away. Bale. Oh, shall he me do that? Way up and away. <laughs> the Minas gets up to head it. Breaks on here. Iniesta with the ball through. Some astute defending to ensure they got no further. Muni Ayin. And it's Muni Ayin. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Dos Santos gets it back. Lamina's crop point blank header. What about it? Just one goal in it now. Game on. Just so calm under pressure. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a eel the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defense, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they've done so well to get back in it, but it's important now that they don't become over-eager in chasing another. They only need one more chance. Patience is key.
minutes on the touchline, a change about to occur. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Dos Santos passes it through. Massive lead! And in again! Oh, he couldn't get hold of it. How was that a fucking corner? Rest. Have to get it into the box and quickly. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Rest of a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Like a good ball through. Let's hit one! Dante boots it to safety. Oxley Chamberlain goes looking. Rudy Ayin. The defence can get it clear. The final whistle. Peterborough winners by the odd goal. It really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? I thought it lived up to its billing, Peter. Very competitive, wow. open and entertaining. And a little debating room as to whether the outcome was fair. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day. You know you've had a hard game when your goalkeeper's got man of the match. Fucking hell.